ketosis. Stored abdominal fat is toxic, contributing to insulin resistance, requiring more insulin to maintain normal blood sugars. A low carbohydrate diet plus moderate aerobic exercise will reduce insulin sufficiently to transform the toxic fat and convert it to a beneficial natural pharmacy, namely the safe equivalent of potential harmful medications, for example, appetite pills, amphetamines, dangerous diuretics, and addictive tranquilizers. Ketones are the breakdown products of a liberated fat. They can be measured in the urine by a test strip called ketosticks. I recommend two ketostick tests daily, on arising and at bedtime, because they have different interpretations. If you eat nothing during the night, you should awaken with a positive test for ketones, light pink, because of decrease in insulin when you are fasting. A negative test reflects a surge of stress hormones, called the dawn phenomenon, because it occurs in the early morning hours. These agents can convert fat and protein into sugar, which is the equivalent of having eaten carbohydrates during the night. The bedtime test for ketones should be positive unless extra carbohydrate has been consumed. Testing for ketones is the most important indicator of the successful weight loss program. It should not be confused with diabetic ketoacidosis, which is usually confined to type 1 diabetics severely out of control.